right? We're converting between uh, prefixes, uh, decigrams to grams, doesn't get simpler than this. It's just uh, right to the base. Um, when you go from uh, one prefix to another prefix, then, then it takes, a, takes another step. But in this case, going right to the base unit. That's uh, simple as we can ask. All right, so 750 decigrams is what's given. Uh, that zero is not significant, right? So that's two sig figs going to be in our answer. All right, decigrams, and we're going to need a conversion factor to take decigrams into grams. All right, so we need decigrams on the uh, denominator and grams in the numerator. So that way we can cancel out what we don't want and end up with what we want. All right, now can't just do this and not put the appropriate numbers there because what you put in here has to make this conversion factor equal. And by doing that, you're essentially just multiplying by one. All right, anything times one is itself. In other words, you are not changing the value of this original measurement. You're just simply changing the units, dimensional, analysis. All right, so let's make this equal. Uh, there's a couple ways to do this, so let me, this is just the way um, is most natural to me, but I'll show you other ways, and you can pick whatever uh, suits you. All right, so I know there's 10 decigrams in one gram. That's just the way I would do it, and you're dividing by 10, so it's going to be 750. I'm sorry, uh, 750 is going to be 75, uh, and the unit we're left with is grams. Now, if you, um, if you want to use uh, one of these other conversion factors, they're, they're all the same. So instead of that conversion factor, you can put, um, to solve this problem, you, you have to put decigrams on the bottom and grams on the top. But you can use different numbers here. All right? so you could do like one decigram is equal to 0.1 gram. So if you prefer that, or you can go with like one decigram is equal to 10 to the negative one gram. Um, if you want to use that method. 10 to the negative 1 is just you're reciprocating it and you end up with what I just did. But if any of those works, you're all both you're going to get the same answer. So really, whatever you're more comfortable with, do it because uh, any way you want to get the right answer. All right.